All right, so we are uh, getting these cars looked at now, seeing what's going on. I got my little notepad, writing everything down, what we need to do, what needs to be done. And uh, now, Crazy Boris is going to get it started. Let's let's get this uh, thing started. Beautiful, beautiful. Lights work. We've got HID headlights. So we've decided to take the spoiler off. Um, actually, you can go ahead and comment. Put your comments in the, about the spoiler. What do you think? Yes or no? Yay or nay? Will this spoiler ruin the car or does it work? If you want to keep the spoiler, we'll keep it and I'll make sure it lights up. If not, it's getting scrapped and we're gonna put a new spoiler on here. So comment in the sections below. All right, so um, basically we just went over the uh, the Mazda, the Affini. Uh, so our list of things that we will need to do. Um, we are gonna probably end up repainting the whole car um, I'm thinking that's probably the best bet because I mean it'll just look better and uh, be more presentable yeah. so we're gonna need to fix the rear bumper um, we've got a little part here that's uh, been melted uh, spoiler if anybody says anything you know we'll see what you guys think what you want but uh, I'm leaning towards getting a new one. Uh, let's see. I'm going to get a new front bumper. I'm not going to mess with it. Although I can fix it. I don't know. I don't want to mess with it. Uh, we need to fix the front glove box lock. Get a new radio. Uh, left interior door handle is uh, missing. So we're going to do that. Uh, we're going to... Uh, fix the AC. The AC does work. It's just uh, it needs to be charged. So hopefully it's not leaking. Um, reinstall the rear seat and uh, interior trunk plastic. We need to find that. So other than that, it should be good to go. It's actually <clears throat> looks really good. Seems like uh, less, maybe less work than I anticipated. So yeah, there you go. That's the uh, Mazda. Now we're moving on to the Black Skyline. Let's go ahead and uh, get her started. Sounds like a little belt noise of sorts, but it's pretty pretty good this one is very clean very nice needs a good uh, bathing it came with a whole bunch of brakes so these will be up online soon for sale and FYI Interior. AC works. But I will need the vents. Good. Uh-huh. Oh, AC works. 
steering wheel. Has seen better days, but we'll get that taken care of. No horn. Uh huh. All right, so um, we are now to the gray skyline. So let's get this thing going. What's the, the, the oh yeah, let's. Uh, let me show you some goodies inside. Actually in very good condition. We've got some oil pressure, oil temp, turbo, nice little CD TV thing, touch screen. Um, there is a bunch of stuff that yeah, the horn works that we don't know what it is yet. Like this. I'm not sure what that is. So then we've got Grady, I'm assuming that's a turbo timer. I'm not sure what this is. It turns on. But we're not sure. Um, there are a bunch of uh Ugh, that's a sound. That's it bunch of sounds and everything we're not sure what it is yet sorry for the neighbor this guy is kind of retarded so anyway uh, we went through everything let's turn it over uh, we went through everything and the only thing we got is put gas in it we got to charge the AC uh, clean up the wires because it's a mess over there with all these wires everywhere and uh, there's a, a, a noise in the rear that we're not sure what it is yet, um, but we will uh, we'll be checking that out. Uh, it could be a differential. I'm not sure. Could be anything, but it's nothing. It's nothing serious. Just we haven't lifted a car yet. Oh, maybe sway bar link. Sway bar link. Yeah. So yeah, that's it. Basically, uh, this one's almost ready to go, uh, and we will be repainting. Definitely got to repaint this thing. This is just disgusting. That is horrible. Horrible. I don't know. But yeah, it's, uh, yeah. Oh, no, yeah. That's it.